A shire is a traditional term for a division of land, found in Great Britain, Australia and some other English-speaking countries. It was first used in Wessex from the beginning of Anglo-Saxon settlement, and spread to most of the rest of England in the 10th century. In some rural parts of Australia, a shire is a local government area, however, in Australia it is not synonymous with a «county», which is a land's administrative division. Etymology The word derives from the Old English scir, itself a derivative of the Proto-Germanic schizo cf. Old High German syra, meaning care or official charge. In the UK, shire is the original term for what is usually known now as a county, the word county having been introduced at the Norman conquest of England. The two are nearly synonymous. Although in modern British usage counties are referred to as shires, mainly in poetic contexts, terms such as Shire Hall remain common. Shire also remains a common part of many county names. In regions with so-called rhotic pronunciation such as Scotland, the word shire is pronounced. In non-rhotic areas the final R is silent unless the next word begins in a vowel. When shire is a suffix as part of a place name in England, the vowel is unstressed and thus usually shortened and or monophthongized. Pronunciations include, or sometimes, with the pronunciation of the final r again depending on roticity. In many words, the vowel is normally reduced all the way to a single schwa, as in for instance Leicestershire or Berkshire. Outside England, and especially in Scotland and the US, it is more common for shire as part of a place name to be pronounced identically to the full word, as a result of spelling pronunciation. <inaudible> <inaudible> Origins The system was first used in Wessex from the beginning of Anglo-Saxon settlement, and spread to most of the rest of England in the 10th century, along with West Saxon political control. In Doomsday 1086, the city of York was divided into shires. The first shires of Scotland were created in English settled areas such as Lothian and the Borders, in the 9th century. King David I more consistently created shires and appointed sheriffs across lowland shores of Scotland. The Shire in early days was governed by an ealdorman and in the later Anglo-Saxon period by royal official known as a Shire Reeve or Sheriff. The Shires were divided into hundreds or wapentakes, although other less common subdivisions existed. An alternative name for a Shire was a Sheriffdom, until Sheriff Court reforms separated the two concepts. The phrase, Shire County applies, unofficially, to non-metropolitan counties in England, specifically those that are not local unitary authority areas. In Scotland the word, county, was not adopted for the shires. Although, county, appears in some texts, shire, was the normal name until counties for statutory purposes were created in the 19th century. Shires in the United Kingdom Shire also refers, in a narrower sense, to ancient counties with names that ended in shire. These counties are typically, though not always, named after their county town. The suffix shire is attached to most of the names of English, Scottish and Welsh counties. It tends not to be found in the names of shires that were pre-existing divisions. Essex, Kent, and Sussex, for example, have never borne a shire, as each represents a former Anglo-Saxon kingdom. Similarly Cornwall was a British kingdom before it became an English county. The term shire is not used in the names of the six traditional counties of Northern Ireland. <laughs> shire names in England Counties in England bearing the Shire suffix include Bedfordshire, Berkshire, Buckinghamshire, Cambridgeshire, Cheshire, Derbyshire, Gloucestershire, Hampshire, Herefordshire, Hertfordshire, Huntingdonshire, Lancashire, Lincolnshire, Leicestershire, Northamptonshire, Nottinghamshire, Oxfordshire, Shropshire, Staffordshire, Warwickshire, Wiltshire, Worcestershire, and Yorkshire. These counties, on their historical boundaries, cover a little more than half the area of England. The counties that do not use Shire are mainly in three areas, in the southeast, southwest and far north of England. 
Several of these counties no longer exist as administrative units, or have had their administrative boundaries reduced by local government reforms. Several of the successor authorities retain the Shire county names, such as West Yorkshire and South Gloucestershire. The county of Devon was historically known as Devonshire, although this is no longer the official name. Similarly, Dorset, Rutland and Somerset were formerly known as Dorsetshire, Rutlandshire and Somersetshire, but these terms are no longer official, and are rarely used outside the local populations. Hexhamshire was a county in the northeast of England from the early 12th century until 1572, when it was incorporated into Northumberland. <laughs> Shire names in Scotland In Scotland, barely affected by the Norman conquest of England, the word shire prevailed over county until the 19th century. Earliest sources have the same usage of the shire suffix as in England, though in Scots this was often most schyr. Later the shire appears as a separate word. Shire Names in Scotland include Aberdeenshire, Ayrshire, Banffshire, Berwickshire, Clackmannanshire, Cromartyshire, Dumfrieshire, Dunbartonshire, Inverness Shire, Kincardineshire, Kinross Shire, Kirkid Brightshire, Lanarkshire, Morayshire, Nairnshire, Peeblesshire, Perthshire, Renfrewshire, Ross Shire, Roxburghshire, Selkirkshire, Stirlingshire, and Wigtownshire. In Scotland four shires have alternative names with the Shire. Suffix, Angus Forfarshire, East Lothian Haddingtonshire, Mid Lothian Edinburghshire, and West Lothian Linlithgowshire. Sutherland is occasionally still referred to as Sutherlandshire. Similarly, Argyleshire, Butcher, Caithnesshire and Fifeshire are sometimes found. Also, Morayshire was previously called Elginshire. There is currently much debate about whether Argyleshire was ever really used. Shire names in Wales Shires in Wales bearing the Shire suffix include Brecknockshire or Breckenshire, Carnarvonshire, Cardiganshire, now Ceredigion, Carmarthenshire, Denbyshire, Flintshire, Monmouthshire, Montgomeryshire, Pembrokeshire, and Radnorshire. In Wales, the counties of Marianith and Glamorgan are occasionally referred to with the Shire suffix. The only traditional Welsh county that never takes Shire is Anglesey in English, in Welsh it is referred to as Sir Fawn. Topic: Non-county shires. The suffix shire could be a generalized term referring to a district. It did not acquire the strong association with county until later. Other than these, the term was used for several other districts. Bedlingtonshire, Craikshire, Norhamshire and Islandshire were exclaves of County Durham, which were incorporated into Northumberland or Yorkshire in 1844. The suffix was also used for many hundreds, wapentakes and liberties such as Allertonshire, Blackburnshire, Halfshire, Howdenshire, Leylandshire, Powdershire, Pydarshire, Richmondshire, Ripponshire, Salfordshire, Trigshire, Tynemouthshire, West Derbyshire and Wivelshire, counties corporate such as Hullshire, and other districts such as Applebyshire, Bambergshire, Bunkleshire, Carlisleshire, Coldinghamshire, Coxwoldshire, Cravenshire, Hallamshire, Mashamshire and Yetholmshire. Richmondshire is today the name of a local government district of North Yorkshire. Non-county shires were very common in Scotland. Kinross Shire and Clackmannanshire are arguably survivals from such districts. Non-county shires in Scotland include Bunkleshire, Coldinghamshire and Yetholmshire. <laughs> shires in Australia Shire is the most common word in Australia for rural local government areas LGAs. New South Wales, Victoria, Queensland, Western Australia and the Northern Territory use the term shire. For this unit, the territories of Christmas Island and Cocos Island are also shires. In contrast, South Australia uses district and region for its rural LGA units, while Tasmania uses municipality. Shires are generally functionally indistinguishable from towns, borough, municipalities, or cities. 
Three LGAs in Outer Metropolitan Sydney and four in Outer Metropolitan Melbourne have populations exceeding that of towns or municipalities, but retain significant bushlands and or semi-rural areas, and most have continued to use «shire» in their titles whilst others have dropped «shire» from their titles. These «city shires» are Sydney Sutherland Shire which is locally referred to as «the Shire» The Hills Shire, the Garden Shire, previously Balcom Hills Shire, Hornsby Shire, the Bushland Shire, Melbourne, Shire of Nilambic, the Green Wedge Shire, Shire of Yarra Ranges, Shire of Cardinia, Shire of Mornington Peninsula, which is locally known as the Peninsula, Shire of Pakenham. Topic. Shires in the United States of America In 1634, eight «shires» were created in the Virginia colony by order of Charles I, King of England. They were renamed as counties only a few years later. They were Accomack Shire since 1642 Northampton County, Virginia Charles City Shire since 1637 Charles City County, Virginia Charles River Shire, now York County, Virginia. Elizabeth City Shire, now consolidated with the city of Hampton, Virginia. Henrico Shire, now Henrico County, Virginia. James City Shire, about 1642 to 43 James City County, Virginia. Warwick River Shire, now consolidated with the city of Newport News, Virginia. Warosquioke Shire, now Isle of Wight County, Virginia, as of 2013, six of the original eight shires of Virginia are considered to be still extant, whilst two have consolidated with a neighboring city. Most of their boundaries have changed in the intervening centuries. Before the province of New York was granted county subdivisions and a greater royal presence in 1683, the early ducal colony consisted of Yorkshire, as well as Albany and Ulster, after the three titles held by Prince James, Duke of York, Duke of Albany, Earl of Ulster. While these were basically renamed Dutch core settlements, they were quickly converted to English purposes, while the Dutch remained within the colony, as opposed to later practice of the Acadian expulsion. Further Anglo-Dutch synthesis occurred when James enacted the Dominion of New England and later when William III of England took over through the Glorious Revolution. A few New England states and commonwealths namely Vermont, Massachusetts, and Maine, still use the term Shire Town for their county seats, although they use the term county, rather than Shire. The word also survives in the name of the state of New Hampshire, whose co-founder, John Mason, named his province of New Hampshire after the English county. See also Comarcus Comarcus of Spain Comarchs of Catalonia Counties of England Counties of Scotland Counties of Wales Counties of the United Kingdom Gao <laughs>